Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So I've got a, a parcel to look at today. Oh, I've got it upside down. Look, <laughs> it's a frowny face rather than a smiley face. So yeah, it's an Amazon smiley package. Uh, and yeah, I hope you got to this one before I did. So uh, yeah, anyway, it's my thing. <laughs> So, yeah, I think he was uh, wanting to get into it to see what it was. And, um, yeah, it does look like actually Millie, our little Scotty dog's been at it. But, no, it was hubby. <laughs> okay. So, let's have a look and see what we've got this time. Oh. And let's have a look. So, I may just have been using Vipon coupons again. Um, I just can't stop looking. I must stop looking, but I can't stop looking. <laughs> I do like a bargain and it's two sets of kings but this one looks like it's got extras with it this is a lot bigger than i was expecting okay uh they are both from the ming sh store um on amazon and as i say i've used a vipon coupon that's v-i-p-o-n not affiliated not associated don't get anything for mentioning them um but they do have some pretty good special offers or they point you to special offers on amazon so it's possibly worth just downloading the app and just having a look if you don't like it you can always delete it again but uh, yeah i got both of these for i think slightly less than half price one of them so let's have a look at this one first because it's got some extra bits with it that uh, i'm sure they were on the website that you got extra bits okay uh these are a little bit halloweeny as well so i know february yeah we're a little bit early for halloween but i do like to plan in advance and when it's a bargain you've just got to get it what can i say <laughs> okay so the price of these was seven pounds 99 on amazon and i got them for three pounds and 59 pence which is amazing when you consider it's come with extras as well wow maybe they've seen how many i've been buying and thought well you better have something extra <laughs> i've been and had a look on amazon and i can't see where it says that you get an extra and the extra is oh stickers so these are all sugar skulls, put them that way around. Uh, yeah, that's the label with them all done. And that's the actual stickers. So we've got a pack of stickers with this, £3.59. Wow, I think you'd pay that probably for the stickers. Heck. Okay, we like freebies. I like special offers, but I particularly like freebies. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's a nice little sticker to go in my logbook because I do like to keep a track on the special drill things that I've done as well and to where I've got them from. Uh, that's a nice little leaflet telling you how to diamond paint. So if you're new to diamond painting, then that's uh, pretty comprehensive telling you what to do. We've got some uh, little drills there, the acrylic drills. Have a look at those in a second. We have our little toolkit. Everything's little. Please stop saying little. <laughs> We have our starter toolkit, pen, boat and wax. So we are on uh, half-term holidays here in the UK. So this would possibly be great for uh, my granddaughters to have a go at doing. But yeah, I mean, I think sugar skulls, although there are skulls, some of them can be really scary. But I just couldn't be scared by one with like a handlebar moustache and a sombrero on. <laughs> And this one looks very, very colourful and pretty. Uh, he looks a bit scary with his teeth, with the like big eyes there as well. Yeah, I think they're pretty good to do. I think children would probably quite enjoy doing them. I was thinking the other day, it's funny, I was talking to my mum and I, I used to have um, a keyring skeleton and I was absolutely obsessed with it. And it was the first house I ever remember living in. So I was probably only four or five-ish. And I can remember one of its legs dropped off. It was all like, it was about this long as a key ring. And it had like the head and the body and then the arms and legs had like um, jump rings on them so that they moved. And there was joints at the elbows and the knees and the hands and feet. And I just loved it. So I ended up with two. I ended up with a broken one and one that was okay. 
and so uh, yeah i don't think they're overly scary <laughs> strange child i know but they're quite a good size as well those aren't they where's my tape measure let me have a look so these are a little bit smaller and these are a little bit bigger size i wonder if they match uh, the ones that i've got as the key rings have to have a look so this larger one here is about seven and a half centimeters and yeah oh he's about eight centimeters so he's a little bit bigger which is three inches and three and nearly a quarter inches and then the smaller ones at the bottom just in case you're needing to know are six centimeters which will be about two and a quarter inches and then he's got a sombrero so he's three and a quarter inches which is eight centimeters Don't look right way up Liz. give yourself a fighting chance of being able to read it and then these are sort of just under five centimeters which is just under two inches and this one is five and a quarter centimeters which is about two and a quarter inches so yeah Wow, I can't believe that, that I've got those in free with it as well. Okay, excellent. We're leaving a good view, review for these. Right, oh, and these are all crystals. Oh, and look, we've got square crystals in this one as well. Yay. Okay, these look a bit scary. <laughs> okay, oh my goodness me. Oh. oh, we have got five. I was just thinking there's only four there, but we have got five. Right, so we have our basic toolkit again, pen, butt and wax. We've got our keyring attachments, which check we've got five. We have lobster claw clasps, five of those. There's a little bit of noise today because Hubby's got his friends over for the afternoon, which is wonderful. And chains, we have one, two, three, four, five. Excellent. And yep, yeah, these are your really good lobster claw clasps. I've got quite a few sets of these key rings now on quite a few unboxings. But yeah, these tend to be the easiest ones to use. And then, okay. And then they just literally, they've got the ball and clasp fastening. So you just pop that through your skull and put that on there, that on there. Okay, so oh, look at those specials. Wow, let's have a look at the actual key rings themselves. So we have five, they're quite sticky, so they will need sealing. Um, I've said before, I think what happens is when they actually um, put the glue on these, uh, it, it tends to squish out the edges underneath the cover sheet. So it just makes it a little bit sticky. That one has still got its little... This one has still got its little um, piece of perspex in. It's been punched, so just pop, pop those out. Um, otherwise, you'd be like, I tried the other day and I'm trying to thread the chain through, not realising that actually the hole hadn't been punched out. So we've got this goldy colour. He's quite a serious looking one, that one, isn't he? A definite front on skull there. Okay, but they're not the same as the stickers anyway. So that one's a side on. Oh, he looks a little bit menacing. Be interesting to see what it looks like when he gets his teeth. I wonder what colour his teeth are going to be. If they're gold, it'll be like. <laughs> and this one looks a bit more like a sugar skull because it's got a little bit of flowers on it. Okay, so oh, that one's got a really big smile. I'm going to smiley skull. Oh, I say, I don't know whether that's worrying or okay. <laughs> this one's got a grimace again, look. Uh, again, the sugar skull with your flowers. And um, yeah, this one looks like he's got quite a few gaps in his teeth. So again, a good size. Um, yeah, we're talking probably about a three inch square. That's about the same size as that. So just give you another quick measurement, but quite a few good colours on them so yeah about five and a half centimetres that one's just a little bit bigger that's six centimetres because he's sort of a different way around which is about two and a quarter inches which is about two and a half inches so yeah nice sizes 
will definitely be uh, statement pieces. They are double sided as well, which you know for the money. I mean, I can't believe I've only paid three pound fifty nine for five key rings with the lobster claw clasps and the chains, and then we've got five free stickers as well, two tool kits. We've got all the um, different coloured uh, acrylic drills there, and then we've got all these special drills here. We didn't have a look at those drills, did we? But I think you can see the colours anyway. Okay, let's just open this packet and have a look. Oh, lots of specials. Okay, I must admit these keyring sets, um, the shop that they're from is Ming SH. I'm presuming that could be the manufacturer or the manufacturer that they're using. Uh, it certainly gives you plenty of drills and different colours and everything. Uh, they certainly don't skimp on them, that is for sure. Look at all these. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen different gems and colours on five little key rings. That's just amazing. It's fantastic. Okay, so let's start at this end. We have a nice sparkly silver and a black with a silver backing and a little cherry red there, a very gold gold. So let me just see, what were those teeth going to be? Teeth are number one. Uh, oh, was it I? Could be I. Oh, I think the teeth are I, so yeah, he's going to have those gold teeth. So this skull is all this gold and he's going to be smiling. Maybe his teeth are silver and they're reflecting off his, uh, that one's skull. <laughs> We've got two packets of, oh no, I think actually. Oh no, they are. I thought I was just thinking that looked a bit dark blue, but no, they are two packs of your standard black. So we've got a black with a silver back in and two packs of standard black as well. Are they black? Yeah, I think they're black. So then we've got the two packs of that gold. And they're two different greens. So we've got like a darker green and then a little bit paler. We've got a white there, which to be fair, I think I will use ABs. Because I think if we're going to have all this bling, we might as well have a bit of AB as well. Because there is quite a bit of black edging on them to sort of like make everything else pop. We have a hot pink, yay! I'm calling hot pink. And a nice aqua bluey green. Some little half sphere golds there, very pretty. Uh, some of those like um, gold marquees that have the silver backing. And all those square golds. Where do the squares go then? Let them brush that into his. Ooh. Ooh, look, it's his teeth. He's got square teeth. <laughs> oh, and that one's got square teeth as well. He's got, oh. Uh, ooh. Maybe it's not, oh, uh, maybe it is, ooh. <laughs> so, yeah, squares. They're big squares as well. Oh, very good. Okay, and then we've got some green. Uh, iridescent coated marquees, AB coated marquees. We've got uh, two of these green flowers with the gold in the middle. They're actually like a, a button and um, they've got holes in to be a button. Uh, but yeah, they're fine as a, a gem. You don't notice the holes once they're on the canvas or on the little project. So sadly, we haven't got any spare because we do need two. But that's set uh, to go on your little skull there. One for each side. But that's okay. The others just look super. So I can forgive them for only giving us two. And then we've just got some larger green faceted rounds there. <gasps> wow, we do like this set. I just can't believe the value of it. Again, if you're wanting them for fundraising, I mean, heck, you've got a freebie with it. So you're on to a winner to start off with. All these put away in here and 
see if I can get these chains into this bag. No, I'm not even going to try. Let me get a different bag, a bit bigger bag. That's better. Put them all in here. Okay, yeah, squashing those all into that little bag. It's certainly a skill that somebody's learnt there, isn't it? <laughs> Okay, uh, we'll just have a quick look at these acrylic drills that go on the stickers. I mean, to be fair, you could use some of your sparkly gems on these. You could uh, match up your colours a little bit. I can't get into this. Where's the end? Come on. Where is the end? Is it there? Is it there? Got it. The struggle is real. <laughs> oh, right. Oh, my goodness. Okay. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten different colours on the stickers. So you could, if you've got crystals, you could match your colours, get say like a buttermilky or a very pale gold, um, your cherry red. You can use your white and your black anyway. Purple gems, green, I mean, we've got a green in there. Aqua blue, hot pink orange and gold so you could match all those up to your gems and then just rather than using these use the numbers to match up onto there and do them all in crystals so that they match your skulls so you could do it as like an extra if you were uh, say making somebody it as a present you could give them a sticker to go with the key ring mm -hmm. or you could sell them all separately whatever you want to do if you're going to take them to a craft fair or something yeah, look at those. Oh, hot pink in both. Yay! <laughs> okay, so I want to have it first. Well, two sets really. They all came as one set, but there is two sets there. So the other one is on a similar theme. And we are still on Halloween. And the price of these should have been $8.99. And these were half price at £4.49. Again, less than a pound a key ring. Gosh, just one of those days where I want to do just a little unboxing, show you my little bits and pieces I've got. Then I get uh, the boys downstairs deciding to start playing on the stair lift for some strange reason. It's been there, well, three years, four years, <laughs> and they've been several times, and today they've decided to start playing on it. And, and by boys, I mean my hubby and his two friends. And then the telephone starts ringing. <laughs> Welcome to my world. Okay, so again, back to key rings. So this one is a basic toolkit again, pen, boat and wax. And we've got hopefully one, two, three, four, five of those little key rings. I won't take them out of the bag. Uh, we've seen them in the other packet. And we have, ooh, ooh, look at that one. These are all um, like ghosts type pumpkin things. A bit nightmare before Christmas-ish, I think. But uh, yeah, you'll probably know better than I do. I, I, I've not seen that one. And then all the special drills. Okay, so let's have a look at these. They're different colours. So he's like a, a sort of ghosty type sack head. Look at his teeth. I think they're all going to be those white teardrops that I've just seen in the specials. So they'll really stand out. He's got a very big smile. An awful lot of teeth in that mouth. This one is like a, a blue pumpkin head. Okay, with quite um oh he looks like he's up to no good. That's quite I won't say evil, but quite a wickedy looking ha 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 type expression. Oop, this is another blue one. That one just looks exceptionally worried. <laughs> He's wondering what he's going to get up to. And he's saying, I don't know, but I'm going to keep smiling. <laughs> this is another one. And he's just completely oblivious to it all. And he's just smiling away in his own little world. <laughs> and then this one, that could be mummy. That could be one saying, if you don't be, then you'll all be in trouble. <laughs> So we have a pink one. So we've got a sort of like an aqua one, three bluey ones and a pink one. So this will be interesting. Ooh, this one's got a lot of black around here. I wonder if that's going to be teeth or whether that's just the skull or the pumpkin that's uh, going a little bit bad. Ooh, let's have a look at these drills then. Right. 
so yeah i mean i suppose really i would have been better getting these around halloween but then they might not be on special offer at halloween so i might as well get them now family and friends as i've said before you'll all be getting key rings for all eventualities this year <laughs> I think they've all got the holes punched out of these. Yeah, they have. They've all got the little hole already punched. So, how many colours have we got? Oh, look at those. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's only eight different gems and colours on these, but wow. Okay. So, it's not a hot pink, unfortunately. It's nearly a hot pink. It's a hot pink having an off day. <laughs> Look at that aqua greeny colour there. That's a real jadey aqua. And then we have an AB coated green, which means you get that iridescent coating that gives you a real oil on water effect there. Look at those. Wow, I didn't expect that. And then that's those little white pearly teardrops that are going to be those pearly teeth. And then some little blue marquees there got your standard silver very sparkly and then we've got your black and your white so let me have a look oh so these three skulls then that are actually shaded blue are actually going to have the plain white on them oh now that would be interesting and i have got an awful lot of ab whites um, if any, if you've been following me a while, uh, then you will know in my stash I have got a lot of these white ones with the iridescent coating. Uh, if you haven't been here before, hello, welcome. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. But yeah, so I could possibly do them all in AB whites. That would use some of them up. Again, all double sided. So wow. So is that colour then? Is that the AB? green let me have a look hey yes so this one although it's like a turquoisey blue is actually going to be the green ab oh well if he's gonna have an ab the others are gonna have to have the ab coating on as well aren't they and then this one is just this palish pinky color now i have got some hot pink gems so i could do it in hot pink to be fair I have got a lot of spare crystals. Again, if you've been following me a while, you will know I have got a lot of spare crystals. <laughs> but they are just super fun. Uh, give them a quick measure. I think they're going to be about the same as the uh, skulls and the stickers. So we're about six and a half centimetres. He's, a, oh, he's about six centimetres, which is two and a half inches and he's two and a quarter and then height wise this one is about just over two inches and he's two and three quarter inches which in centimeters is seven centimeters and five and a half centimeters so yeah oh wow do you know i'm very very impressed with these i mean i've loved all the others that i've had as well but these are very very pretty i don't like them oh i've just realized it's like you've got four sort of standard shapes in each pack and then one just a little bit different shaped one very good okay well uh, i hope you've enjoyed looking at these with me as i say just something a little bit different possibly a little bit early for this halloween but hey ho <laughs> that's just me okay well i hope you've enjoyed looking at these with me if you have as always a thumbs up is very much appreciated any comments or questions in the comments down below and if you would like to come back and see what i get up to next then if you press that subscribe button down in this corner and the all notifications bell that pops up you'll be notified when any of my videos come up so you won't miss anything yay okay thanks ever so much for stopping by and i do hope to see you all again soon bye for now